So now we have our Ad AdWords editor downloaded. We went into our computer and we opened it up. Real simply, we're just going to add in our AdWords account. So we're open the browser. It gives you a code. Copy that. And we're going to come down here and paste it. Okay. All campaigns. And it's importing our AdWords account. And we're using this test dummy account that we created our AdWords Express ad in. And this is it. This is where you're going to work out of for your uh, in the AdWords editor. So you can see you can you can clone accounts. You can really copy and paste anything over and over again, and you do all your editing in here. And it won't anything you edit won't set live until you post it. So let's say we we clone that campaign. We want to create a new one. Let's go into it. Go into the ad group. Okay, group one, you change the name, BBC calls, or whatever, you know, doesn't really matter. Go into your keywords, negatives, locations, and I mean, this is just another, it's just an app where you can edit with that. So, so you know, you know what AdWords editor is actually comes in handy is because when you try and change ads and stuff live in the, in the AdWords account, sometimes like say you want to change the URL from we're using clicksgeek.com to xyz.com. If we start changing ads, if we go to an ad group and go under ads and start changing ads from clicksgeek.com to xyz.com, it's going to flag the account and and, dis, and uh, disapprove the ads because we're you're not allowed to have more than one URL in an ad group. So I mean it's easy to fix, but it's just a pain in the ass. So AdWords editor is AdWords editor is just a good place to come where you can make tons of different changes all at once. And then just hit post, and it'll just go live to your to your actual AdWords account all at once, so you don't run into any issues. I mean, that's really it. It's just a place where you come, you import your campaigns, and you can just you can basically come in here and you can either manage the campaigns in here, or you can just do edits whenever you want.